I think the most trickiest burn that I did was on Hitman's Bodyguard, which is at the end of the film. Uh, so at the end of the film, you know, uh, Samuel Jackson's character has escaped from prison. He's in some kind of South American bar dancing with Salma Hayek. And out of nowhere, a bar fight stuff happens. And a guy comes in on fire in the background, stumbling through stuff out of frame as the camera sort of zooms in and closes on the actors. Now that for me was probably the most scariest job I've ever done because all it needs is someone to slip and trip or land on me or me to go and I'm on fire with my hand. You know, obviously if you're not expecting, you're gonna go flying mm -hmm. and land on someone. And our two principal actors were wearing, well basically they were no, dis no different distance from where you were. Mm -hmm. I was running past here. And obviously I'd rehearsed it that when I did the stunt, because my worry was the visibility. Plus I got lights inside the, the set. Um, and all you need to do is lose your bearings and you have no idea. And also what ends to happen is that sometimes your lenses fog up. Mm -hmm. So if your lenses fog up and you lose concentration, you don't know where you are. So you'd have to literally go down onto the floor. So I changed the fire stunt to suit my performance. So I moved the snooker table or a pool table where I was coming through a doorway right in front. So I knew that as soon as I came in, I would hit the table and buckle up on it. I then turned 45 degrees, went running along the, uh, hit the bar, the actual bar of the actual the club, went along the bar, and then I used my hand at the bottom to know that I was at the end of it. Mm -hmm. And at the end of the bar, there was a dance stage, which obviously you know, had a little platform. But if I turn and clip that, there's a chance I'd go fly and either go through the set mm -hmm. or just land in a heap. So we rehearsed this multiple times and then I rehearsed it with my eyes closed. Now, even though it's something that's relatively simple, mm -hmm. my concern was the cast and the other stuntmen. Mm -hmm. Either I would trip and land on one of them, or one of them could trip and land on me. But the main thing, as long as I didn't lose my bearings, um, and that it was it was a confined space. Um, and you know, we got it in one take, and it was great, and you know, it all went perfect.